Hello everyone. Godavari and Deepa and Arya meet after a long time and recall their first day at secondary school. I think we should go play. But where? On the ground? But we have classes hey. again. Hi. Hello. How are you? Great. I'm very good. Do you remember your first day at secondary school? It was such a fun day. Yes, I was extremely excited on my first day at secondary school. I also clearly remember my first day at school. My father had accompanied me to the school. He was proud of me because I had passed my primary exams with flying colors. In the primary school, we had only one teacher for teaching all the subjects. But in the secondary school, I came to know that there will be different teachers for different subjects. This made me nervous. Nervous? I was not nervous because I was with my friends from primary school. The older students took us on a tour of the school. We visited the art room, computer room, science laboratory and sports ground. In my case, a teacher took all of us into a hall. She gave us some interesting story books to read. My first day of secondary school was not so good. When I arrived at the school, the playground was full of big boys. I was a little frightened. No one helped me find my class. I was late. The teacher was angry. I felt miserable and I was in tears. Oh, our teachers were very friendly. We felt quite happy when we met them. My first lesson was in the science laboratory. It was my first experience of doing something on my own. I was nervous in the beginning. But the teacher and both the lab assistants were very helpful. Soon, I stopped feeling worried. So you were all scientists on that day? <laughs> no, no. My first few days in the secondary school were terrible. But soon I was comfortable and started enjoying my lessons with my new friends, especially computer lessons. Regarding studies, I could understand science, but mathematics was not a piece of cake. But last year, we got a wonderful teacher for mathematics. He changed my perspective. I understood the basic concepts and started solving complex problems on my own. Now, mathematics is my passion. We all are in different schools and different classes, but I'm sure we all agree that we love our school and our school friends. School is the place we always want to be. Yes. yes. So now we can go play? Yes, let's go. Collocations. Let us have a look at the conversation. They have used quite a few collocations. Now, what does collocation mean? Collocation means a natural combination of words. They are specific to each language. They refer to the way English words are closely associated with each other. For example, joint family, extended family, close relatives, keep in touch. Here are a few collocations about study and learning which were used in the conversation. Primary school, secondary school, basic concepts, complex problems, school friends. Adjectives We use many words in our conversation which tell us something more about the noun. A sentence can make complete sense even without such words. But if we add these words, the sentence becomes meaningful and it carries a greater value. For example, I saw a flower. I saw a beautiful flower. Now here the word beautiful tells us more about the noun that is the flower. Samir is a boy. Samir is a clever boy. The word clever tells us more about the boy. The words beautiful and clever, these words are called adjectives. Definition An adjective is a word, part of speech that provides more information about a noun or a pronoun. What did we learn? Collocation means a natural combination of words. They are specific to each language. They refer to the way English words are closely associated with each other. Adjectives Definition An adjective is a word, part of speech that provides more information about a noun or a pronoun. Exercise Identify the collocations from the below sentences. 
ambassador car belongs to the old generation of vehicles the city will be hit by a natural disaster it was a rainy day sorry wrong number i had a very tight schedule this month there are some weak points in her argument wild animals should be kept in their natural habitat geeta is my best friend biting your nails is a bad habit eating healthy diet is the need of the r identify the adjective and the noun adjective is telling more information about this word from the below sentences there are 5 books on the table today we caught several fish my uncle has a big car rohit carries a heavy bag every dog has its day sita is wearing a colorful dress sunil bought a new pen amit has a blue shirt diamond is a precious stone it was a strange experience 